Hi, I'm Lily Gorman, the visual media editor and senior at Coppell High School's The Sidekick. Hi, I'm Drithi Reddy. I'm a student at CHS9. Well, this year we kind of, we didn't really know what we were getting into, you know, with the pandemic and stuff. Um, but like going to CHS9, it's like you already know a lot of the kids from um, the middle school. So you're basically going to school with kids you already know. Um, and like you don't, I mean, it, unless you're in like activities or like extracurriculars or like sports, um, you don't really get a chance to develop like relationships with um, students in like higher grade levels and stuff um, but for me since I'm I'm a part of the Coppell volleyball program um, I've made friends that are like in sophomore year or their junior year um, but yeah and I've I've been online and in person this year so it's it's kind of been a little hectic this year for sure yeah I can imagine yeah my freshman year I was extremely intimidated I didn't know where I was going um, I was involved in theater mostly at the time, uh, just because that was what I sort of, you know, as freshman, you don't really like jump into something unless you came from it in middle school. I knew some pe I like had people I knew in middle school, but I ended up meeting a lot of seniors. Most of my friends I met were sophomores that year. Um, I was friends with all different grade levels. It was very intimidating, but it was nice because I felt very included in the high school. That was something I like. I was worried about was like feeling like, like too young or like not included in things because I'm like new. But I think the high school that like because CHS nine didn't exist at the time. It was like it was very welcoming towards freshmen. It was like everyone's trying to recruit people for their programs and such. Do you feel like disconnected like when you're in programs like volleyball and stuff like that? Um. Well. Okay, well, this year, because of the pandemic, I know a lot of things have changed, especially in, like, activities and stuff. So, in a normal year, like, um, everybody, like, all grade levels would be, like, super integrated, and they'd, like, work together, like, every day. Um, but this year, like, they didn't move a lot of freshmen up to higher teams and stuff, you know, COVID and, and all. Um, but usually we do, like, team bonding, like, dinners. That's you know, nice. Yeah. Um, but I feel like we were kind of deprived of that this year. Um, and I, in a way, it kind of gives us, like, an opportunity to, like, go out and actually, like, for ourselves make those relationships. Like, um... I know, like, I'm friends with a couple of sophomores and stuff um, on the volleyball team, and, like, not we, not that we were, like, forced to be together or anything, but just, just to get to know everybody, like, yeah. you know, um, you had to, like, go out and kind of put yourself out there, which was a little out of my comfort zone. Yeah, freshman year was definitely, like, we're a family, we're gonna bond, we're a family, CHS is a family, which it is, and I'm not trying to seem like it's not, you know, it, like, it got to that point of where you're you know, you're getting to be close with your APs and stuff like that and who you're involved with but it was very pressury especially because you know the, it was first of all there wasn't a pandemic yeah, yeah. second of all it was like you know you're with everyone in the school so if someone sees you in the hallway that you'd be like they noticed you again I'm using theater as my example they like saw you at this theater event for the freshmen they're gonna be like oh my god you should come to this. It's we're family. Again, not saying it's not. I'm trying to. I'm not trying to like make fun of that whatsoever. But I feel like that pressure was definitely sort of there. So it kind of is nice that you guys. You, it was more on the freshman end of them to be like, okay, I gotta like talk to people. Because so I like definitely was like. I don't want to say scared by that, but I was like, oh, <laughs> hello. Yeah, you were overwhelmed. Yeah, yeah. And I get that. But um, if, like, I would totally want to go to school with, like, everyone, you know? Because, um, like you said before, like, I, I do, now that I'm looking at it um, from a different perspective, I do feel like we are, like, disconnected. And I'm sure you had, like, so many, like, relationships or, like, friendships with, like, um, upperclassmen and stuff. But, um, 
you know, I can't really think of a lot of friends that I have in upper grade levels. Yeah, because yeah. I was talking with a friend and we realized that I've been in the school at CHS twice as long as a junior because of just like because of like how like I've been there since freshman year. It's only their second year, it's my fourth year. Like talking to seniors, like it, I feel like it was more intimidating. I feel like the sophomores that came in this year, like they'll just like, I feel like there's not as much of a, oh, upperclassmen because yeah. they're already like a second like year in high school, but you've never been with those people. So like kind of like, like, I guess, what is that for you? Like, is that a thing still? Are people, like, afraid of upperclassmen? I feel like I wasn't, like, afraid. <laughs> but, um, well, there is definitely, like, some, no, okay, I mean, like, there's some, not discrimination, but, like, you know, there's always freshman slander. Yeah. Yeah. And, th like, that's always going to be there. But, um, I guess you kind of can't really do that when you don't know the freshmen. Like, when the upperclassmen don't know the freshmen and like you know vice versa um but yeah there's always like that like not fear but like oh they're upperclassmen like you know what I mean yeah yeah so next year is probably gonna be like our first or like our first year of high school because like like we don't know all the freshmen like I personally don't know all the freshmen like in a normal year I would have like you know I would have gotten to know so many more people um not not saying that I, I'm, I don't, but it's like this year, um, I actually had to like a lot of my friends are online, so yeah. I'm in person. So I had to like, you know, um, talk to people and like put myself out there and like, you know, like try to be friends with people because I didn't really have anyone. So I think that was a great opportunity for me to make some friends like outside my like closed little friend group. Yeah. Um, so, and I think sometimes like how it would have been had there not been a pandemic like you know um would I still be friends with the same people I yeah. am today? Like, you know, and like um, how the dynamics would be in class and stuff. Because when I go to class now, it's silent. Like, no one yeah. speaks. Like, freshman year, I think the start of high school is where you sort of branch out from your friends and yeah. like definitely explore like meeting new people. Like, because I think by the end of my freshman year, I was not friends with the same person, I, people that I was friends with, you know, like mm -hmm. at the start of my freshman year even like end of middle school and I think like that's so interesting is because you have classes with people and you like end up really liking some of those people in your classes and like they have friends you like and like you have friends they like and you kind of like create you kind of like make new friends and like I think freshman year was that year I like kind of like was starting to like find my people yeah. you know what I mean and yeah. I felt like that opportunity with CHS 9 and this is like I've never been there I can't like speak for it but like I would say like if I went to CHS 9 if I tried to put myself in that position all all I would think I'd be able to like think about is like how I can't wait next year I can't wait to make new friends and like next year I can't wait to like branch out more because I feel like it's like middle school 2.0 exactly like that's I so many of um and I'm sure the sophomores too have thought that and the juniors because they went there too um but I know like talking to so many of my friends and just freshmen in general they feel like it's exactly what you said like middle school 2.0 right there's still room for like to make friends and stuff apart from like the the kids you went to middle school with but um I feel like at the at the high school like you're exposed to more people like all different types of people um when I go to school like now at CHS 9 you know like we're taking into like the pandemic into account and everything um but like I just I just see like a certain type of people like you know um but like I feel like once you get into like high school and you see so many more people like and like you said like find your people right um I see so many like different types of people yeah at the high school and I'm like when I go there to play volleyball I'm just like 
and it just takes me by, by surprise because like like going to middle school and like CHS 9 with these kids like I, I would have never thought like this is how they would turn out or like not in a good or bad way it's just different from what I've been seeing for so long yeah it's because like you know they've found their people and like you're finding your people but like this year it's it's just been hard to do that with you know everything yeah um but hopefully like next year um if we go back in person like I, I know nothing is set in stone right now but if we go back in person like um I'm excited to meet new people